Right, <clears throat> a quick impromptu video. Um, I've just dropped Lily off at school and I've come out to my father-in-law's shop, which is closing this weekend. Uh, I'll get him to explain to you. Obviously, he's finally long overdue retiring. I've come to Butler Bikes and Fishing Tackle, but it won't be Butler Bikes and Fishing Tackle very soon. I've just driven round the back because uh, I've got a bike maintenance place at the back. Paul, my brother-in-law, works here. Um, and it looks pretty empty. I don't know what's in there, but I thought I'd just come and do a quick video round because obviously it's a bit of posterity. Somebody's nicked your shop, pal. Blood to hell, fire. Put you need sat that bloody brother-in-law of mine. What a mess he's left this in. I know. There was, uh, there was no time yesterday. Everything was coming off the shelves and deck painting and goodness knows what. God, mate. And then got a fella come in from one of the fishing pools at Rusley and just cleared the lot. Everything. When was that? Last night. Really? I was here till half past six. Well, Kieran was here, Matt was here with me as well, thank goodness. I wish they'd have come down. Yeah. I didn't know. So every every bit of fishing stuff has gone. Everything. Got a few maggots in there. <laughs> Don't need any maggots. <laughs> I've got my own alleged. Look here. Police ring me at half past five this morning. Oh, broke the glass. Put the window there. All the years you've been here? I know. And nothing's ever happened? I know. Two racks. So I've been here since six. Paul coming today? Oh, yeah. Uh, I was just going to ring him just as you come in then. Jacob? No, he's still on holiday. Is he? No. Oh, shame. I'd like to have got him on video. I know. I've come down because I thought, well, I'll just drop Lily off. I'll come, because obviously, I'm gonna make it real, passing of an era, and I thought, I'll come down, and I'm going to make a video and put it on YouTube. <laughs> as a, as oh. a memento to bottle bikes and fishing tackle, and I've got it here, and it looks like you have been robbed. <laughs> the police said that. Have you been in? <laughs> well, we couldn't get through there. No, we? not with the bars on. Thank God. So have you got you called them out? Have you got to get the glass replaced today? Or you just getting bored it up? You have to. The fellow that's coming in, um, and I wish him all the luck in the world, is going to have a dog grooming parlour there. And this is all going to be pet foods. Um, oh, that'd be nice. So he's bought these shelves off me. He's bought them two off me. He wants a CCTV. Um, I mean, the lawn was in here anyway. And he was buying all the bikes and everything and sell all them? Well, this fellow, the, uh, um, Edward, that had all the fishing stuff off me, he says, right, no, I've got tyres and wheels across the yeah. road. None of the only bikes I've got left. These are repairs that will be going out today. Um, so just then left. Yeah, you'll have the bikes <clears throat> and everything that goes along with it. And you know, I'll just wreck them all and, and I'll give you a good price. It'll be nice if you come and fetch a lot. Yeah. Because Saturday's D Day. Yeah. Is it Saturday? Last yeah. day. Last day. I shall be in on Sunday <clears throat> morning just to bits and pieces. Well, come in for your final, smoke your pipe and That's have it. a cup of tea. Oh, oh uh, every time. Murph will be with me. 
I'm looking forward to it now, Gary. So you should be. I am. How long have you been here now? 17 years. Crazy, isn't it, mate? It's only seems yesterday when you started. So yeah, I've come down. Bucknell bites some fishing tackle in Bucknell, Stoke on Trent. As you can see, it's all been bleeding emptied. They came in yesterday and emptied it. So, been coming here for years. I drove in round the side, the back. Some tow rags last night smashed the window. First time that's ever happened in all the years it's been here. When the bin was outside, you'd know the shop was open. Hi, Paul. Fuck off. <laughs> Paul loves being on camera, Paul does. He loves it. <laughs> That's my brother-in-law. <laughs> the one that looks just... Well, he's not that ginger now. He used to be really ginger when we first met. And he, in, years ago, I'm standing in Tesco. And we're waiting to be served, me and Paul going out. And there's this little kid. And he's, he's tugging on his mum's jacket and he says mum mum that shaggy off scooby doo <laughs> <laughs> i've got to beep all this out now for my video paul you used to cut keys here that's all gone little kitchen janie had come down and wash dishes for him And all this has got to be emptied out. Yeah. Everything's got to go <coughs> by Saturday. It's now Thursday. So somehow all this has got to go. A book. A book. What do you need a book for, Paul? You got to do a stock take. Well, not a stock take, but I need to know a general how much. Money's worth it is here to see if they want bites or not. You're, you're brave now that you've lost your gingerness, aren't you? <laughs> hey? <laughs> I don't know, you dare. You walk in a room, you can see your stomach coming five yards before you. Yeah, I'm fucking right. Oh, fishing's gone, mate. Yeah. What's that? Shop. What are they? Doctor Susie. So, oh, they're the dead old fashioned ones, aren't they? Nobody, everybody has LED now, don't they? I'm not getting charged for them, I'm not getting fucking. Thank you for that. No. I'm surprised you haven't found it. Like we were saying earlier, a couple of old dynamos. I'm gonna have to put music over this. I can't. I can't put any of this footage on YouTube because of that <laughs> bloody. Well, guys, what can I say, mate? End of an era. End of an era. There'll be some tears shed on Saturday, mate. By you or the people that you're leaving? Probably everybody. Hey. Everybody. What do you say? How many? How many years? Seventeen. Seventeen years. Yeah. Bucky bikes. Yeah. Because I got it wrong, so butcher, copper, environment officer, and then this bike shop stroke fishing tackle. That's the one. And the only reason he brought it so that he got an excuse to sit in the back by the gas fire, smoke his pipe, and drink cups of tea. That's all. That was the only reason. And you're, read, you're dead right, though. Exactly. Mate. That's what we always said. Along with dozens of other people. Oh, I know. Every time you come in, this was. The focal point of this area, this was. 
little Ken, every Saturday morning, he brings um, two litres of milk, all the cakes from the bakery in Aldi or Little Lizzy, Top of Dibbity Road, which one's that? Whichever one it is, every single Saturday. Uh, and he'd be in the morning, no doubt it'd be the same. Because when I first, when I first came here, it was because Mac worked here, didn't he? Yeah, yeah. Uh-huh. Mac he used to one. help out. Mac was here with Alan Jones. Age. Ah, age uh-huh. that we lost. Age. Ah, uh-huh. God bless him. Uh-huh. And you were slim young and you got ginger hair Paul when you started. So what are you going to do with yourself, Paul? As little as possible. Started well, as a Saturday boy. Yeah. Retire? I was thinking about uh, Retiring. Being there. Uh, a red boy, an international porn star, or an astronaut. I'm just going to that one. I, I think, That's well, why don't you put the two that. together and become the first porn star in space? That's a very good idea. That's a very good idea, that guy. Zero <laughs> gravity bump font. Absolutely. <laughs> Elon, can you send another SpaceX up? He's got a prolapse. <laughs> right, I'm going to bugger off. All right, mate. Th- thanks again, Gary. It's all right, mate. Um, say all these counters are going tomorrow. And then it will look empty, won't it? Well, it looks pretty bloody empty now. I was hoping come film it while it's still got some stuff in, but... Back to ah. I don't know, mate. I don't know what's going to happen, mate. I've had some very, very loyal customers, mate, in 17 years. They've, had, they've drunk plenty of tea and coffee. Some good times. Ah. Huh? Janet's sausage rolls. Ah. Ah. Uh, I don't know. Been fun. Huh? All good things come to a close. Absolutely. Thanks, guys. Cloud baby, standing on my toes on the edge, I'm ready to go.